Hi guys, welcome to a Tech Game 180 video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install a hacked Minecraft client. So what you're going to do is go on to wizardhacks.com and click on Minecraft hacked clients and basically search for the hack client of your choice. They have loads on the website to choose from, all running different different versions to the latest version of Minecraft, which is 1.7.10. Um, all running down to, I believe, past 1.6.4, uh, so you'll be able to definitely find one that you like. Um, the one I'm going to install today would be Notice 2.0, the latest version. And all you do is press on it like I did, and then you'll basically go come down here and press download. Then it will take you to the page, and then it, you'll download it in a zip file. So as you guys can see, once you've downloaded the file, you'll get it in a .zip file. All you need is a program to extract that, so I'm using WinRAR. I'll put the link to everything in the description. All you do is basically when you've installed WinRAR and you've got your pack downloaded, all you do is click extract here. Before I do that, I am just going to scan it so you guys know it's safe because in my last video I had a couple of people saying is it safe and stuff well I'm going to scan it with Norton just to prove that it is so as you guys can see no fresh found so that is all good so what I'm going to just do is click extract here and as you can see we get two folders one for the Mac and one standard um, I'm just going to delete the Mac one because we're not running on a Mac and you can also delete the zip also because you're not going to need that anymore so what we're going to do is open up the notice folder and inside that folder you will actually get a couple of files this basically all this uh, stuff in here is not really any useful to me the only thing I want out of this folder is this the notice.2.0 with the two files in the .jar and the .json so what I'm going to do is just basically keep that in there for a second, minimise you, and basically go down to your start, and press in percent, app, data, and percent again. Then you'll come to a folder called roaming, and once you're on your roaming folder, go to your .minecraft, and then look for a folder called versions. Then once you're on there, all you're going to do is get up the the uh, window what you had before with the notice and just basically drag the notice folder in here and make sure you've dragged the right one on and that's the one with the dot jar and the dot json because that's basically the hacked client so you can close that off now and you can close your dot minecraft off and now let's launch the minecraft.exe okay guys so my launcher has loaded and what you're going to do is press on come down here and basically press on new profile and basically I am just going to call this copy of my username and notice the reason I've got um, already something called notice is because I basically pre-installed this before but I'm just going to redo it again so basically as you can see I've just called it that and you can call it whatever you want it doesn't have to be the name of the mod or anything it can be whatever you want but once you've named it and stuff like that then you can come down to version selection and basically go down to use version and basically look for your hack client there's a load of lists so do remember to check all these and basically there's mine called notice so I'm just going to select that if you can't actually find it in the list do remember to click these options because basically these will actually add more lists because some of the hacks might be in alpha some of the hacks might be in beta and some of them might even be snapshots so do remember to click these if you can't find your client so I found mine so all I'm going to do now is click on save profile and as you can see now it's selected and all I'm going to do is hit the play button and jump into Minecraft. And as you can see now the Minecraft's fully loaded, I've come onto the menu and it's definitely the hack client because it says notice dot 2.0 in the background. I'm just going to open up a single player so, as you guys can see, the world has loaded, and I believe, I, because I already installed it, and I already had a mod working on it, I believe I had the nuker on. So, that's basically, I believe, still on from the last time. So, just to prove that it, this actually works, I'm just going to put on, um, let's do spider. 
let's put that on and what you do is just press enter on that and as you can see I've got high jump, no fall and a spider and, um, and nuka enabled what I'm just going to do is unable nuka there you go and let's see let me watch me climb up some walls this does work on multiplayer but I can't really show you on multiplayer on this because I do not have any servers currently um, added but as you can see it definitely works and as you can see I, I can spider up the wall so yeah guys hopefully this helped don't forget to leave a like and comment on this video and also don't forget to subscribe so yeah yeah tech gamer tech gamer unboxing reviews and an entertainer with tutorials and gameplay he's a technological guy going all the way with frequent videos always coming out click that subscribe button to see what he is all about like the video share it with your friends drop a comment below where you can vent what you love and what you want to see next time so tune in every week for the next time i hope to see you around thanks for watching tech gamer on the rise never stopping